Welcome back to Isis YouTube channel with me, Shafa Sabha Safira. So, in this video, we will learn about castle verbs with carry. So, without further ado, let's get started. So, today's lesson is about castle verbs using the verb carry. A castle verb is a combination of words. A, a verb a preposition or verb plus adverb that when used together usually take on a different meaning from the original verb now i know you've seen many of these personal verb lessons carry usually carry a basket or you carry a child it means you move something with your arms you carry it right so, most of those have to do with the idea of carrying something. Now, here are some of the frasal verbs with the word carry. The first is carry on. What does it mean to carry on? It means continue. So, for example, Jimmy wants to carry on his father's tradition of having a barbecue every Sunday with the whole family. There is also carry on with. We often say carry on with and carry on with is a little bit different. When you say hey, carry on with someone, it usually means you are flirting or it could mean to have an actual affair. To have an affair with someone, to carry on with someone. Second is carry over. Carry over could mean carry something from here to here physically. But it could also mean to move something to another time, another place. For example, people say the meeting we had, we had too many things to speak about. We didn't finish everything on time, so we will carry it over for tomorrow. That is how we use carry over. Then, Another example, when people say tomorrow we will start again and finish what we need to do. So, also carry over could define as move to a different time, place, and position. Third, carry back. Carry back means sort of like remind but more in terms of nostalgia. Nostalgia is just takes you back carries you back to another time and place, and also a different mindset, etc. The fourth is carry around, meaning to physically carry someone or something to many places or to tow someone or something around. So for example, if you feel very, very guilty about something you did or something that happened, you carry that guilt around with you for your whole life. So, it is like a weight on your shoulders and you're carrying it around, even though it's just inside your head. 5. Carry off. Carry off means to complete something successfully. For example, you had a big presentation at school. After the presentation, your teacher comes up to you, he goes like, you carried that off great, good job. So, carry off uh, also means to take away. For example, people say I picked him up and carried him off into the sunset. The sixth, basically carry out. It basically means to do, or more correctly is to perform. You carry out a task. You do something. If the teacher asks you to do something and he wants you to carry it out as soon as possible. Alright guys, that's all for today's video. Uh, kindly give this video a like, comment, and also share. And for you who haven't subscribed to Isis YouTube channel, don't forget to subscribe guys. In this we believe in English with Chef. Thank you and see you in the next video. Bye!